The purpose of this video is to demonstrate how to conduct an odds ratio analysis in SPSS. So the demonstration is based on the handedness and dyslexia data where the hypothesis was that there might be a relationship or in this context a greater odds of being dyslexic based on your handedness. And so to conduct the analysis in the context of an odds ratio analysis, you do it in the same way that you would a Pearson chi-square analysis. So click on Analyze, Descriptive Statistics, Cross Tabs, put the handedness variable in rows, dyslexia in columns, and click Statistics, and click on Risk. And so basically what happens is that SPSS is going to output results related to both odds ratios and risk. I'm only going to interpret the odds ratio in this video. Click Continue and click OK. And here we have the handedness and dyslexia cross tabulation table, which is exactly what you would get from a Pearson chi square analysis. And here we have the results. I'm just going to clean this table up a little bit. There we go. So the risk estimate, in terms of the odds ratio analysis, it's the first row that you want to be looking at. And it says odds ratio for handedness, right divided by left. And in this context, if you look in the textbook, the manner in which the formula worked out, based on how the data were coded, the results imply that there is a 13 times greater likelihood of being diagnosed with dyslexia if you are left-handed versus right-handed. So to state that again, the odds are 13 times greater to be diagnosed with dyslexia if you are left-handed in comparison to right-handed. And the 95% confidence intervals, the lower and upper bounds correspond to 3.45 as a lower bound and 49.80 as an upper bound. So that's how to conduct an odds ratio analysis in SPSS and interpret the results. I'm going to do a separate video related to risk.